considering a fluid flow situation. A low velocity motion is characterized by fluid particles moving along smooth paths in laminas with one layer gliding smoothly over an adjacent layer. That is a laminar flow regime. With increasing flow velocities, there is a critical velocity above which the flow motion become characterized by an unpredictable behavior, strong mixing properties, on a broad spectrum of length and time scales, that is a turbulent flow regime. This is illustrated in the following photograph and movies, showing a modified Reynolds experiment in the hydraulics laboratory at the University of Queensland. In the first experiment, on the left, the flow is laminar. In the second experiment, on the right, the flow is turbulent, as evidence of the strong dye mixing. This movie shows a laminar flow with flow direction from right to left. The second movie shows a turbulent flow with flow direction again from right to left. In turbulent flow, the fluid particles move in very irregular paths. This causes an exchange of momentum from one portion of the fluid to another. Turbulent flow have great mixing potential and involve a wide range of coherent structure length and time scales. In many natural stream and atmospheric flow, the fluid motion is turbulent and strong turbulent mixing occur. This is illustrated with this movie, showing turbulent smoke dispersion downstream of an incineration plant, chimney in Toyohashi in 2001 at sunrise. The following dataset present instantaneous longitudinal velocity measurement in a developing turbulent layer. boundary layer. A key feature is the highly fluctuating nature of the velocity and also of the pressure, not shown here. In the industrial pipes, laminar flow are observed for Reynolds number less than 1000 to 2000. And in turbulent flow, this occurs with a Reynolds number greater than 5000 to 10,000. The Reynolds number characterizes the ratio of initial force to viscous force. In the Moody diagram, the Reynolds number is defined in terms of the equivalent pipe diameter, dh, equal to four times the cross-section area divided by the weighted perimeter. For a circular pipe, of course, the equivalent pipe diameter equals the pipe diameter. Osborne Reynolds was a British physicist and mathematician who expressed first the Reynolds number in 1883 with this gravure showing his original experimental apparatus. More generally, the transition from laminar to turbulent flow is a function of the flow typology, boundary condition and inflow condition, with a few examples listed here. The notion of laminar and turbulent flow are fundamental concepts in fluid mechanics, hydrodynamics and hydraulic engineering. They are discussed in the relevant YouTube video movies in the same playlist.